It's a miracle time. Well, today we have the joy of baptizing little Aiden Patrick Hostelli Tane. Now he's about 15 months old, and he's the son of Tila, who we know because Tila joined the church this last year. Um, before I call Tila and Aiden and some family members up and some godparents up, I want to read a passage from Acts. We're told in Acts 2 that on the day of Pentecost, Peter told a whole crowd of beginners to repent and be baptized, and you'll receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. He said that the promise is for you and for your children and for all who are far away, everyone whom the Lord our God calls to him. Well, friends, today as a whole church, we hold fast to that promise that it is true for us and it's true for little Aiden today. Baptism is a sign of salvation that God has given us through Jesus. The water itself is a sign and it's a symbol of God cleansing us from our sins, washing us clean. Scripture talks about dying with Christ and rising with Christ, going in the water and coming out of the water. God's new birth for each one of us. We also, though, know that today for little Aiden, this is not the completion of faith. This marks the beginning. There will be a time for him later in life to decide to follow Jesus as his Lord and Savior. So we do this today in hope and anticipation of that day, that the Holy Spirit will seal uh, what we begin here today, what we mark, and he'll bring it to completion in Jesus Christ. So I'm going to go ahead and call Tila and Ava to come join me here at the Baptism Pond. I'm also going to call up grandparents. We've got Norma and Henry here with us. We have uh, Fatima with us too. Um, and we've got some godparents. Carol and Craig have uh, committed to be Ava's godparents and Support him, pray for him, um, point him to Jesus as he grows. Tio, I'm going to start today with a couple questions for you as Aiden's mom. Uh, Tio, do you believe in Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior and follow him as his disciple? And do you promise to raise Aiden to be Christ's disciple, providing nurture and guidance within the community of faith? until he's ready to profess his own faith. I do. Okay. And T.Y., I know you have a couple scriptures to read, and Tammy's going to hold the microphone there for you. Yes. Okay. <laughs> For you create my innermost being, you knit me together in my mother's womb. I praise you because I'm fearfully and wrongfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know you that full well. You watched me as I was being formed in utter seclusion, as I was woven together in the dark of the womb. You saw me before I was born. Every day of my life was recorded in your book. Every moment was laid out before a single day had passed. How precious are your thoughts about me, O oh God. They are innumerable. I can't even count them. They outnumber the grains of sand. And when I wake up in the morning, you are still with me. Search me, O oh God, and know my heart. Test me and know my thoughts. See if there is any offensive way in me, and lead me along the path of everlasting life. Therefore go, therefore go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Tammy has a couple questions for all of you now as the church that's committing to me. And the answer to these questions will be, we do. <laughs> Just in case you were wondering. In anticipation of Aiden's free response to God's call, do you, as members of the Church of Jesus Christ, promise to help Aiden remember his baptism today and God's calling on his life. We do. And do you promise to guide and nurture Aiden by word and deed, with love and prayer, encouraging him to know and follow Jesus Christ and to be a faithful member of his church? We, we do. do. Thank you, congregation. I think that uh, an infant baptism, a baby baptism, it's such a great picture of grace because it's God working in us and on us and around us before we're even aware of God working. 
I think we've got another great picture today, though. We've got this very international community. <laughs> you know, hear lots of accents and lots of French, especially today. And I think about the passage you read from the end of Matthew about baptizing in the name of Christ going out to all the nations. And uh, Aiden's a very international little guy as we do that today. So I'm going to see if he lets me perform that. God, thank you for little Aiden, and thank you for this water, Lord, the water of your creation. You brought your people long ago in the creation through the flood. Lord, you brought your own son through the waters of baptism in the Jordan River. And we ask that you bring little Aiden through this water today as we baptize him. So Aiden, I baptize you today <laughs> in the name of the Father. You can't wait to do that. In the name of the Father. T'arrives à temps. T'arrives à temps. Ah, super. Bonjour Eden. Oh, bon. Le pauvre, il a été mouillé. Oh, oui. Bonjour madame. Bonjour. <rire> il souhaite. Ça va, c'est bon. Oui, c'est bon. Good morning, church.
He wants to get up. Let him get up. Whatever. Whatever. You guys don't want to take a picture of, I'm not going to. When we do come to the vote, 